Okay, I guess I need your help on this thing too. I want to understand a little bit better Sephardic Jewish. Because I'm it's coming up a lot of my videos. As you know, my when my mother took the heritage test, DNA test through my heritage, it revealed that the on the Italian side, she was basically mostly on that side one of the grandparents was actually Middle Eastern and the other was ultimately Sephardic Jewish. Help me sort that out. So if you're Sephardic Jewish, does that mean you, how Jewish do you have to be to be Sephardic Jewish? Does that mean you're Jewish but you've got Spanish blood mixed in? Or does it simply mean that you're Jewish and you happen to be in Spain or could it be either? Because now I'm a little bit confused on, we know that obviously my, my mother's other set of grandparents are Mexican. So they're Spanish through that side of things. And that shows up in the DNA test. And when I took the test, it actually showed that I'm like 33% Spanish. But on my mom's test, that Spanish showed up as Sephardic Jewish. So it's interesting because I would have never known this Sephardic Jewish thing if it weren't for my mom taking the test. <laughs> so for me, it shows up as Spanish. For hers, it shows up as Sephardic Jewish. So if someone's Sephardic Jewish, what does that exactly mean? How Spanish are they? How Jewish are they? Does it matter? If you simply were a, a Jew living in Spain, that makes you, help me sort this out. I'm really confused. And, and, and really... Like I already said, I mean, my mom's DNA showed up as Sephardic Jewish on that side. Mine only just got lumped in with Spanish. So she has the more predominant Sephardic Jewish part of that Spanish blood. And when it got to me, it just translated to Spanish instead. Help me sort that out. I, I don't exactly, I, I'm, I'm having difficulty even explaining this. It's confusing. Comments right there. Please help me out.